it's Olivia. I hope you're having a happy and healthy day. Today we're going to be doing a scavenger hunt outside and it's fall time where I am and I'm going to give you guys a list of some things on the next slide of what you can look for and I'm going to try to find some of those things today at my local park. So come with me. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to try to find today is a yellow leaf, and there's plenty around, so I think I found one. So this is my yellow leaf. Okay, so item number two I'm going to try to find is a flower. So let's go look for a flower. Since it's fall time, I'm not sure if there's going to be a lot of flowers out here, but I'm still going to try to find one. Whoop, here's some white flowers here. My second item on my list, a flower. So the next thing I'm going to be looking for is a multicolored leaf. Okay, here's one. This one's pretty in red and yellow. So here's my multicolored leaf. Okay, so I am going to be taking you guys on a little road trip down this hill right here because I'm at a McIntyre Park and there's actually a creek down here you guys can look at. Okay, so here's the creek. And while I'm down here, I'm still looking for an animal right now. And I'm also looking for a green leaf as well as a little stick or twig. And while I'm down here, I actually do see a bunch of green leaves. So... I will just pick that one off of the tree. So now I have my green leaf. And also on my list was find a unique place for a picture. And I think I found just that. This is a really neat tree. It's really tall. You can see how tall it goes. And then at the bottom, you can see all of the exposed roots. So I'm going to take my picture right here. So now I'm just gonna head back up the hill. And I got my stick. Now I'm going to focus on finding an acorn. And I'm still looking for an animal as well. So I'm just going to tell you guys a little bit about this place while I'm looking for stuff. This is O'McIntyre Park. I used to come here a lot as a kid and I actually was in the O'McIntyre Park District uh, soccer program here where I played soccer. So this place is very dear to my heart and I love it here. And today it's about 70 degrees, so it's a perfect fall day. It's like an Indian summer here. And I'm going to show you guys some of the places that were my favorite when I was a little kid. One of my favorite things about this trail is the fact that along it, there are playground activities stationed um, throughout the trail. And the one that is my favorite that I'm about to show you is a set of bars. So I'm going to show you that real quick. This is another one of my favorite places out here at this park. This is the soccer field that I always played on. And you can see over here to the side of me is a beautiful fall tree that I always remember uh, being by this field. And it just reminds me of soccer season so much. And I just love this place. And it was one of my favorite things to do as a kid. Currently, I'm looking for three things right now something unique, a red leaf, and an acorn. So I feel like it's going to be a little bit hard to find an acorn because I feel like all the squirrels have stolen them for the winter. But I'm still going to try to look really hard. Usually I feel like I can find them around the base of the tree better because they get stuck in the mud sometimes. There's one. So I did find my acorn, and I'm still looking for something unique and a red leaf. So, I'm surprised there's not 
lot more Rise of Leaf from this because I actually haven't been able to find very many all day. court here and although I am surely no Serena Williams I really enjoy tennis as a pastime it's something I like to do with my friends a lot so that's the last spot at this park that is my favorite okay so I officially have found everything on my list so now all there's left to do is to go home and make a jar out of the stuff I have collected for today and I'm going to show you guys the one that I actually made when I was a child and compare the two. So I am home now and I have all of the stuff I collected today right here. Um, I got like four leaves, uh, my acorn, flowers, twig, and this was the jar that I kept everything in when I was a kid that I found. And I'll just show you some of the things that are in there. I have a lot of leaves in there. I can't, I can't even tell you how old these leaves probably are, but I also have like a couple acorn caps in here. And I actually have um, a feather, a bird feather, and I'll just try to show you close up some of the other things that are in there. Um, there's a couple acorns on the bottom. You can see there's a pine cone in there. Um, there's a wood chip right here. Um, there's a rock in here. There's just all kinds of things in here. So this can just be a cute little decoration or a memory jar. And this can be from one scavenger hunt you decide to do or maybe ones through all of the seasons. But um, this is really awesome because I actually have it filled all the way up to the top. So I will probably just add the ones that I found today to this jar. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it inspires you to get out in nature if you can. And if you can't, I hope you enjoy this video and getting able to see the things that I saw today. And I hope you have a happy and healthy day. Mm -hmm.